Salutations, my name is CryptoCell and welcome to what could be the very first episode of a brand new series about Cube World. Cube World is an RPG game, so it's running around killing things, getting better because of it. It's currently in alpha, that means that it has a high potential for bugs, uh, many features are not yet implemented, but it looks really cool. Now before I am going to explain everything about this game, or at least some of it, I'm going to start this game, because I don't want to stay in this screen all the time talking about the game, I want to be in the game. So I'm going to press start game, new character, alright, create. Now I haven't played this game before, so I'm as fresh in this as you might be. So we have race here, we have human, elf, dwarf, which is not my thing. Orc, a green dwarf, a lizard, which is kind of cute. Undead and frogman. And that's it. Alright. Um, I like the fact that they added some more original races. So I'm probably going for undead. I like undead. I am skin and bone, so I might as well just skip the skin. Gender, I'll keep that on male. Class, you have warrior, ranger, mage, and rogue. I like the undead mage idea, I think. Face, what can we change about your face? Oh, the color of the eyes, and the frown. I don't want you to frown at me all day, so... And green eyes, because I really like green. Make a haircut, oh, that's a bit emo. Then again, it is a skeleton. Um, okay. Oh, this one, this one is kind of cool. Uh, a hammock. Right. Okay. Hmm. So, going for this one. Being bald is... Yeah. Many, many, many different colors of hair. I think I, I'll just go for something... Like grey. Uh, that's really lame, isn't it? I'll go for dark. Do I want dark? Yeah, why not? Let's just do that. Alright, I guess we're going to enter a name. Well, let's not try to be cre too creative. Did I spell it right? I did. New world. Well, sure, why not? C must be a number. Let's start with name. Um, Tarto Cube. C. A number. Uh, I just have to plot down a random number. I really, really do not like random. So I'm going to think about a number just for a bit. I found a number. It's 2207. Oh, <laughs> Let's select it, 2207, 2012, uh, yes, this is in European dates, so we have day, month, year, that's the date of my very first Carter Craft, so let's press create world and see what happens, please wait, well, okay, sure. Alright, so about this game, it's a voxel based game. What that means is it, the game just pieces together many different little blocks. The land of Talmir, or something like that. So, oh, can I zoom out? Yes, yes we can. Ooh, first person view. I like when the game does that. Alright, so it's voxel based. As you can see, we have all these little blocks. Everything's made up of little blocks. It's kind of like Minecraft in that aspect. However, Minecraft has blocks with textures. In this case, voxels... Oh, I don't know what to just do. In this case, voxels are in fact just one block with one color. You can see that in my character as well. Each little block has its own color. So that's the true definition of a voxel. It's a technically a 3D sprite. Now, the reason this game is... Oh, I did it again. Why this game appeals to me immediately is it's 
like Minecraft in the sense that it's infinite, technically. I am, by the way, trying to understand the controls while we're at it. Oh, no, that was a waste of potion. Uh, so that's what Q does. Um, oh, you can jump. Um, so yeah, it's technically infinite. Oh, you can even slow walk. Uh, of course... Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, oh, whatever. So it generates infinitely. Uh, oh, I don't think I want to fight that. And... Creatures scale according to your area and technically you can go up to level infinite. You kill monsters, you level up, you know, the generic RPG stuff. But... It's because you can... I did it again. I'm so used to just pressing left button in Minecraft that I'm doing it here as well. So, technically, you can reach level infinite, and when you are level infinite, which is, of course, a contradiction in itself, only then will you reach power 100, so it scales from 1 to 100, and in lower levels the increase in power is more noticeable. That's what I've read, so I'm guessing, yes, and this is the map, as you can see. We have an area around us. I'm guessing that's a town. I'm guessing those are dungeons, I read about those. You do not want to go in there, just yet. Mountains, more mountains. So I'm trying to go over there, which is in the northeast. Always try to find the village first. Of course we're going to scavenge as much as we can. So, apparently you can dodge somehow. Oh, I don't know what uh, map options do we have. No, we do not. Uh, I'm going to utter render distance. That's really a uh, <laughs> hefty thing on your computer. Well, it still works fine. Anti-aliasing. That's... Oh! So, as mentioned, it's alpha. And it has a tendency to crash, especially when changing your options. Yeah. Oh well, I was actually just trying to find a way to look at the controls. You can see that the anti is working, it makes the lines a bit more smooth, especially visible on those things, whatever they are. So, oh, that's a help. This is probably my character, crafting, inventory, let's go to that. Oh, ability, help pick up or interact, both E and R, oh, E is pick up, R is interact, light, special item, call pad, I'm so going to forget all of this, shift walk, free aim, uh huh, <laughs> control climb, space jump, turn chat, mouse 1 normal attack, mouse 2 special attack, mouse 3 dodge, Ooh. Okay. Oh, it's a lot slower now. You're probably not going to see much of the difference, but I'm going to change it back. Um, light. Oh! That's awfully cute. Hmm. Anyway. Be gone. No. Yes. So this is our inventory. Yes, it is. Cold bracelet. Uh, power 1, damage 4, HP 5. Oh, that's an item. Would want. Um, can I equip this? I can. Can I? Yes? No. I cannot. Can I? Yeah. So, now I'm... <laughs> uh, ooh, these skills changed. That's so Guild Wars of them. Yeah, the skills change. 
Oh, we're going to try out the low skills. We're going to start with staff. It, it won't show me what the skills do, do it? Oh! Uh, this is specialization. Oh, well, I can choose this already. Oh. Not going into that anytime soon. I just want to know what my skills do. But I can't, apparently. This is my crafting panel. Uh, no. Can't I just look up what my skills do? Well, that's a shame. Wait, where did my... Yeah, there we go. Um, yeah, I want, I want, nope, nope, it's, oh, I'm chatting, friends. oh, it's back in my queue again, good, 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 um, so, yeah, I'm going to, I'm just going to record one episode with this analyzing, and if it doesn't suit my taste, I will change it, so, we wanted to go north east. Yes. I I for a mole. Ooh. Ow! No, no. What does this do? What is this? Why avoid it? Uh okay, so this is just two. Fire swirl. Oh. Oh ho. Oh. That looks nice. But it didn't drop a thing. Alright, let's check out other weapons. Can I... Oh, just right click him. Uh, uh, this one. Firebolt! So, let me get this straight. We're in a voxel based world. With trees. Throwing fire. So you can burn things down. Oh. That's nice as well. Let's equip these. Oh, you need to do that manually. What? Fireball. Suck it. Fireball. Um, I don't know. Oh, you can shoot quite far, actually. Um, what weapons, what weapons should we use? What are you? Um, a raccoon. You're in red. What does that mean? Probably means don't attack that. I wonder if I can zoom out on the map. On the mini-map, I mean. Ah. Uh, guess not. Well, whatever. Um, so I'm going for the bracelet, or I'm going for the wand or the staff. Uh. So this one shoots where you're looking. By that I mean uh, it shoots where your crosshair is at. Which uh, it's kind of annoying. This one just shoots straight ahead. But it's a bit slower than the bracelets. Oh uh, this one is nice. I think I'm going for the wand. And then Really indecisive. I'm going for this one. Just because ha, it looks kind of cool. Right, that heads north uh let's head northeast. I have no idea what this is. I'm guessing it's a rock. I want to look around, see if there's anything to loot. As any RPG it should have loot. Right. And the birds are Chirping fervently. I really hope it's not too loud. If it is, don't worry. Uh, after this first uh, recording, I I think if I go towards that, they'll just kill me. So why am I going towards that? That can be so unwise at times. That looks like something like. Ah, oh. nice. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. I received cobweb. Marvelous. Why do I want cobweb? Right. Let's punch up. Oh. This is bad. 
I thought it was a mole. <laughs> Obviously not. Well, it's good to check. How long? Oh, I want that one. Oh, it's helping me. That's nice. Oh, it knocked him back. That's kind of nice. It's actually stunned. I won. Oh, my word. Ouch. Pick up the flower and be gone. Ouch. I could use a potion, but that's really wasting it really fast. <laughs> What's that supposed to be? Leave me alone, please. Okay. Oh, I want those. Ow! Just running around stealing pumpkins, don't mind me. Oh, you got to admit that was a nice dodge. That, however, wasn't. Uh, revive? So, I'm now at this statue. Okay. And where am I? So, I revived here. I believe I died somewhere over there. So, that was a lot of bull. Let's pick. Why are there pineapples growing in a field? Uh, what does it matter? We can loot it. Just loot it. So yeah, um, I have no <laughs> no idea what uh, why I'm picking up pineapples. What good it will do me, as I said. Ow, ow, ow! I got boomeranged by what? By a frogman? I thought we were one of the good guys. It. Ooh, dusty linen chest. Only for rangers. Copper coins, now that's good. I'm going to break this just out of spite. I can't break it. Not even out of spite. Is it not a pineapple? Hmm. It's swollen quite a bit. Meep, meep, meep. I can't carry more than 50 of them. Well, that's... A pity. Do we have anything over here? Mm, nope. Why are my hands flaming? I don't know. But it looks kind of nice. No, nope. Can't put torch anything. Is the bull still here? No, he is not. Good. And let's continue. Stealing pumpkins. That's what we do. And I've got 50 pumpkins. Oh, there's a well. I wonder if there's anything inside the well. There's water inside the well. And... Is there any way to swim? Like... Uh, I don't know. Oh, maybe. This will tell us. Um, no, it doesn't tell us. Oh, whatever. Well, I got so much damage already. My top left corner, you can see my uh, damage. How much HP I have and how much experience. Ooh, this looks like a town. Punk R, open. Ah, oh, how nice. Uh, let's get this. What do you do? It's actually, you know, being all foxy. Actually looks kind of cool. Hey, can I talk to you? Um... Okay. Uh, that's very nice. So you're just living here, on your own, in this huge house. Very well. I'll be polite. I am a polite skeleton. That's what I do. Nope, can't even break barrels. Oh, I can examine them. There is nothing special. I should say that in a more devious voice, shouldn't I? <laughs> there is nothing special. What? Maybe I should not say that in a more devious voice. Close. Open. Nothing in there as well. Yeah, that 
camera is a bit annoying when you get inside buildings though. Sit down, examine. Me. There is nothing special. Well, blimey. Um, you can open a lot of things, by the way. There is nothing special. So you can, but it doesn't do you any good. There is nothing special. My favorite sport is hang gliding. Special. Hang gliding is actually a skill you can learn, I believe. So you can eventually hang glide around. Which is kind of cool. So like the first portion shooting feeling this gives me. Terrier. Uh, how about... Y y you can tame pets I believe, but I don't want to try that just yet. Ooh. Uh, e. He is picking stuff up. Um, more fields. Pineapples? No. Can't cheat it by doing it in another field. Uh, can I jump this? Yeah, so that means you can jump three blocks high. That's good to know. Always good to know. And what do we have here? You're a witch. You're a bunch of witches. <laughs> I like your style. Oh, very nice of you. You look like an adventurer. You are looking strange. Which is... Oh, I forgot that might actually hurt them. I don't know. I don't really want to try. <laughs> right, here's an inn. Oh, it's a human. Do you know what raccoons like to eat? Chocolate cakes, of course. So I'm guessing you can tame a raccoon by giving him chocolate cake. Just a wild guess. I love traveling to cities of different lands. How very good. Huh? Wow, what was that? <coughs> yes, over to you for an adventure. Yes, I am. Oh, I'm guessing that's something like a quest, but not working. Maybe something special. How can nothing have anything special in it? Really? Nothing? 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 Is it because it's alpha, by the way? That might be. That might actually be the case. Don't you give uh, this house all the things? A check. And if I don't find anything, then I'll just blame it on it being an alpha. Oh, close the door. Oh, I didn't close this one. Close. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Much appreciated indeed. Uh -huh. It has actually quite a large attention to detail, considering the... It's been foxholes. Oh, does this... No, I don't want to sleep. I oh! Blimey. Wait, wasn't that the inn? I guess it wasn't. I'm lost already. Very nice, very nice. I came in uh, from that way into here. So, oh yeah, so I was in the inn. Now I'm in the inn again because I was just out of the inn. And yes, I am purposely saying that to mess stuff up. I was sure I went somewhere and then fell down, but close. Righty then. Adventurer district. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to <laughs> stop doing that. It doesn't appear to be anything in it any time. Um, another inn. So this was the inn I was just in. There's a town with two inns. I like your style. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much indeed. And what are you supposed to be? A human? I haven't seen you before. Are you an adventurer? Yes, I'm just dying for adventure. Lame joke. What are you? I love me. <laughs> Wait a second. Oh, this is actually a... Asian-inspired... Dummy! Cute. 
Boom. Cute indeed. Uh, looks like an armor, right? Yeah, there's nothing but yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, no, you look more like items. Oh, yes, yes indeed. I have a new pet. I cannot read what he just tried to say to me. Uh, I don't know how to get out of this window, actually. Ah, just walk away. There's nothing special. I have a new pet. It's no runner. I love it. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, let's see. I can't use this. I can't use this. I can't use this. Ah, power five. Uh, that's the level, I think. I don't know. Uh, all, this is all rogue, most of it. I don't know, this is ranger rogue. I could equip that, but uh, not high enough level. <laughs> Certainly not high enough level. What's this then? How does setting work? Oh! My word! Right clicking. Right clicking is how you sell. Good to know, good to know indeed. I'm hanging on to all those. Um, right, getting out of here. Let's open up and close. This is... I don't know what kind of shop. Sells me bags? No, I don't want to see it. Can you sell me bags? <laughs> yeah, pretty much actually. Glass flask. I remember seeing that you needed that for... Crafting something. Iron lamp. But I already have a lamp. Can it run out? Hope not. Wood hang lighter. Ten silver. Um, just show me how much money I have. Um, no. Oh yeah, over here. Uh, anyway, bomb. You can blow stuff up with that. I believe you can even blow blocks all up with that. Formula fair wood boomerang. That's very useful. Common silk short armor 17. Oh, this is stuff I won't be needing in a very long time. This is all just way too much. Let's go out. Um, what am I looking for? I don't know. I don't know. Adventure this oh that looks fancy. I don't know what it is, but ooh this looks fancy as well. Yes, I am easily distracted. What are you? Uh, uh, I have absolutely no idea what this guy wants. But considering he has swords over his head, I'm guessing it has something to do with dungeons. Just a wild guess. Well, you're a ranger. Oh, you're shooting range. Pew, pew. Are you looking for weapons? You should fish in the weapon shop. Well, aren't you the brightest bulb in the box? And what are you? <laughs> okay, do that. Um, another one of these kind of things. I don't like hiking. I prefer riding. Very good for you. Apparently you can ride mounts. So I'm guessing that's what he's referring to. Oh, this looks like a weapon shop. Coming in. There's nothing special and you're standing in front of a person. That's pretty rude. Um. Hmm. Um. This is also way above my level. Very well. Go. What's that? A sheep. Cat. Ah. There is nothing special. Oh man. How can there be nothing special? In anything. Uh, no, I've already been there. Where am I actually going? I don't know. I'm just looking around. And what's this then? I have no clue what this might be. Uh, there we are. 
identifications. I need. I'm. Uh. What? What did? What? What did you? Say? Mammoths are really strong. Yeah, I noticed that. Uh, it was just a bull, wasn't it? Hmm. That felt like a mammoth. And that looks very nice. Can I get in there? I have been in there. Or oh, they open doors without closing them. And I um, fell down. Because I didn't see anything. Ooh, this is fancy. And really inconvenient. <laughs> have to jump up every time. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Just close the door, please. Can I get out of here? Can I fit through a window? I cannot fit through a window. I can fit through here. Whee. Crafting district. Oh, that sounds good. Um, I'm guessing this has something to do with it. Oh, hi. <laughs> Ooh, you saw. What can I saw? What would you? To get wood log. Quite furnace. Silk yarn requires spinning wheel. Quite campfire. Oh, you can make that out of an ice flower. Ah. I think. Yes. Hmm. 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 So, the only thing I could craft is silk yarn. But I need a spinning wheel. So we are going to find a spinning wheel. <laughs> Stupid plant. Uh, yeah, I'll just look for a spinning wheel and I'll be right back. Alright, it's not the spinning wheel, but I did find a furnace, an anvil and the customization bench. Apparently, you can customize your weapons. Oh! Blimey. Now where did it go? There you go. Uh, you can customize your weapons if you have a block. I don't really <laughs> understand much about it. But in due time, I suppose. I can. This looks like a spinning wheel. It is. When, what's this? Loom. What are you going to tell me? Okay. That's very useful, considering you're standing there. Oh! That's cute. If you just press the climb button, you climb. But it costs stamina, so I'm guessing that the higher you go... Craft! Craft! And craft again! Requires loom and twenty of those. Uh, ginseng soup. Oh, you can craft that now. Ginseng root. Pineapple slice. Oh. Oh. I'll be making a few of these. <laughs> Alright, so I found out that the first item here is in fact the item you'll be having there. I'm guessing you can use this to change but I have absolutely no idea how so I accidentally use two potions instead that's kind of stupid but oh, what can okay, you do uh, so oh, there's the respawn is that where we respawned no that was over here can we see that on the map perchance uh, no not detailed enough. Kind of like the maps in Minecraft, but different. Oh my word! Okay. I have some ways to go. Hmm. Oh, what am I hearing? I don't know. But I'm going to visit you just in case. I guess it's better to respawn in here. Hi. There is nothing special. You hey, really do not have anything better to say than that, do you? Um, pet district. You see? Yeah, no. No, I want to close the door. No. There we go. It takes some getting used to these controls. Or oh, I'm just derpy. Whatever. 
you think is correct. What do we have here? Beds. I have not really a clue what good it does to sleep, but I'm guessing that when it's night, it's a good thing to do. Why do you have something green over your head? Why, why? Over here. Have you already explored Fossil Castle? Look, I've marked the location on your map. What's Fossil Castle? Oh. No, my dear. <laughs> I have not. Well, I guess that's a good... I don't know. Is there something like a quest? Thank you. Okay. Poor, poor man, you don't. But I think that's something we can try to start doing in the next episode. Because it's the end of this episode. It's kind of nice to be able to end it like this. So this first episode is a bit longer than the others will be. I try to cut as little as possible. Just so you know. Oh, and the time and temperature are right top I see only now and why is my map so zoomed out oh it does influence but oh. <laughs> it's kind of between two extremes I guess what do you want anyway uh, I do record this in sessions please remember that so if you leave comments and please do Keep in mind that if I do not uh, respond to them immediately, that's because it may take a while between me actually seeing the comments and the episodes going up. And I just noticed that my bracelets are really shiny. And on that note, we end this very first episode. Thank you for watching and see you next time.